Hello YouTube, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate in detail how can we make an automatic sanitizer dispenser machine. The one I'm going to introduce here has a flow control and a delay timer so that there is no wastage of sanitizer, even if you hold your hands continuously. Let's go in detail with the items required and the circuit diagram. This is the circuit diagram I'm proposing for the design. You can see a proximity sensor, a transistor, a relay and a pump. Then few small components such as resistor, capacitor, diode, LED and a small buzzer. Let's see the different proximity sensors we have. Two kinds of proximity sensors are available in the market as shown here 1 and 2. The difference between them is, for the first one, the output will be logic high when there is nothing detected and when something detected, the output will become logic low. And for the second one, it is vice versa. In our design, I removed the transmitter IR from the proximity sensor and extended it using wires. Here I am using zero PCB because I always prefer to have a firm connection between all the items. So let's begin connecting the proximity sensor to the PCB. Then we connect the transistor firmly. Then we will connect the resistor to the base of the transistor from the out of the proximity sensor. Then we are going to connect the relay module there. Then we will be connecting the capacitor. This capacitor will be using as a delay circuit and we will add a resistor in parallel with the capacitor to discharge a capacitor. Then we will go ahead with our uh, circuit diagram as mentioned earlier. Now we will connect the main input, the red and black wire. It will be going to the USB connector once we are done with our body. Now we will connect the pump to the setup we made. For the pump, the black wire we will be connecting to the negative or proximity sensor and the red wire to the normally open pin of the relay pin. Now we will add a buzzer to the setup in parallel with the pump so that when the pump works the buzzer will be. All our connections as per the circuit is over. Now we are going ahead with the body of the sanitizer. To make the body of the sanitizer I use the foam sheets. These are very cheap, lightweight and much harder. We cut them into the desired shapes. This item I am using as a valve control. When you loosen it, more liquid will flow and when you tighten it, less liquid will be flowing. This is what we are using to control the amount of the sanitizer dispense. Here we assembled everything to the body we made. Remember, the transmitter IR we connected at the lower side of the body and the proximity sensor and the rest of the item we are connecting at the top end of the board. See here, the board and the valve control, the tube and the bottle, everything we fixed firmly. Now we will close the top side. You can see here, we give an opening to adjust the valve. Adjust the valve to control the flow of liquid. Connect the USB cable to the setup. Then switch on the main power supply. And now we are testing. A limited amount of sanitizer came out and it automatically stopped. Thus we made our automatic sanitizer dispenser. Further we made some coloring on that. I done some black coloring on this one so that it looks much better. While coloring, cover the USB port, the valve control and the LEDs such as the receiver LED and the transmitter LED and the valve knob etc. So that the look will be more impressive. After coloring, I added a red LED extra indicating the power on status. After all, this is the final look of the product we made. And this is the way it works. When you bring your hand closer, it will dispense a certain amount of sanitizer, then it automatically stops. If you are trying to keep your hand there, it will not dispense. It needs a time to reset. That's why we are using a timer circuit in order to avoid the continuous dispense of the sanitizer. That's it, we made our automatic sanitizer dispenser machine. This is a portable one, you can run it using a USB 
power bank no wastage of liquid and adjustable valve system to control the flow thank you for watching this video if you like this video share it and subscribe to my channel until i come back with new idea bye bye